Yeah, I got a show for y'all. So this uh, white lady crows um, Cardi B speak at Kamala's rally, and I think she uh, she hit the nail on the head. Yep. Check this out. What's up, y'all? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. Patience, patience. Could you send me the script, please? Come on, man. I don't know what to say. I've been waiting my whole life for this. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris, the vice president, she should be president because I said so and I make songs about wet ass pussy. <laughs> so, yeah. I, I, <laughs> so, yeah. So, you want to vote for, I wasn't going to vote, but now I'm voting. Yeah, y'all, you know? So, I'm voting because she's going to be running for vice, I'm sorry, president of the United States. And, you know, she's good. Uh, and uh, I don't know what these big words mean. But anyway, yeah, so Kamala Harris, go vote, y'all, okay? <laughs> yeah, Malcolm X said this. Yeah. Black people, we're the only demographic of people that let celebrities decide who we vote for. Yeah, it's supposed to be based on your values, religiously, spiritually, and what's best for you and your family. Now we're just, we're so easy and pathetic and inept so long as a celebrity endorses a candidate, we'll go run into the polls and vote for that person. Yeah, I'm not gonna even show y'all that speech. That speech is horrible. I show a little bit. I ain't showing that. Yeah, it was pathetic. She came out like this yeah. is part. Like this woman is just so fake. Um, can you uh show that video, that six second video, and just mute it? She got all this plastic surgery done. Right. To her face and her body. Yeah. And I just think it looks so juvenile when these women get these. Hips put on them? Right. They're like wisdom tooth walking. <laughs> it just looks weird. Yeah. They get this stuff put on their hips, like, I guess that's a BBL or whatever. They give her the wider hips. It just looks, it looks cartoonish. Yeah. But anyway, um, Cardi B, she kind of like responded to Elon Musk or whatever, right? Yeah. There's a video of her talking Elon about called her a puppet, right? Well, they are puppets. I mean, right. you you do you think she uh, didn't get paid to do that speech? Yeah, to be at that rally, she got paid to be there. And most people, especially if you black or person of color, you're gonna vote for Democrat because you, you know, culturally that's the person you're supposed to vote for. It's not because of policy. You're voting for that person because everybody in your family is voting for that person. That's, that's how black people think. A majority of us. Well, they vote that way because the other side is yeah. racist too. Yeah, they say that other side's racist. Yeah. Yeah. But, like, this woman used to brag about drugging men and robbing them when she was, uh, I guess, a, a stripper or whatever. Right. She used to brag about that. You got to do what you got to do. And it's just like, this video I'm going to show, it's like this, I can't even put it into words. This woman's like so frustrating. It's like, yeah. This woman sucks. Yeah, she does. <laughs> yeah, watch, watch her after her speech. She was so proud of herself. Now she finna do it. And she promised me, and she looked at me in my eye like a gangster. She was like, watch. I'm gonna change the up. I promise you. I was like, oh. Yo, she a little gangster. I ain't gonna lie, because my husband was a gangster. Yeah, period. And I believe in her, and I feel like she's gonna change this country. I see, I see. I f***ed with you because you don't act blind. And I was like, all right, all right, all right. I know you see what's going on in the fl inflation. What you finna do about it? She talked about it too. She's not acting blind. That's why I fuck her. Like I fuck her like she a real with her. She's not acting like she don't see it. A lot of y'all, y'all like, oh. But she was just in office, blah, blah, blah. Y'all need to understand. She was waiting for her turn. She was there. She was studying. She was studying. You know what I'm saying? She couldn't do too much. But now she, now she finna do it. And she promised me, and she looked at me in my eye like a gangster. She was like, watch. You voting for Kamala Harris because of her? You need to go get your head examined. Well, that's a lot of people going to go vote for her because of her. That's why they paid her. See, Democrats, Democrats aim for the people that are. That's what they think of black people. Well, they Democrats, they don't like, they aim, their whole audience, they, they shoot for the, the dumb people of society. Yeah, they or, do. Or the misinformed or underinformed person. Yeah. That, Not that's all who, of them are stupid. That's who they shoot yeah. for because 
their policy wise, anybody that's paying attention and has any brains is not going to vote for a Democrat. Right. They aim for the people who don't, who's not paying attention, who can be easily manipulated with race and stuff like that. That's who they shoot for. Yeah. Every last one of them still believe to this day that Trump is a fascist. Yeah. And he's a racist and he's, he's a threat to our democracy. That's why they kept using all these buzzwords. That's why they took him to court and made him a 36 count felon and all this crap. Yeah. Like, like that lady that crowed, uh, Cardi, that's how the, like the white, that's how the white Republican voter think of her. And they I see her as ghetto. Doubt- and that's how they see a lot of Democrat voters, because y'all are, y'all just, I y'all like I ghetto. Wouldn't, I wouldn't doubt white liberals see them like that. Yeah, they see them like that, too. Yeah. But it's because, and when white liberals see them, they just think it's funny, and it's like, oh, they can't do no better, they black. What else could they do? Yeah, at least, at least they're on our side. Cardi B, you're on stage signing off on a candidate that is going to... Put men, well, they're going to keep men in women's sports, going to put men in women's. I mean, if you're a woman, why would you side with that? Because you got paid. Sell out. Like Elon Musk called her a puppet. Like when you went on stage and did your speech, you couldn't even say it from the heart. You had to you had to read it off your phone because that's what they told you to say. This woman let men of illegal immigrants into our country. No, but let me, let me touch on that. They paid her to be there. And they paid you to say what you needed to say, and that's why it was on your phone. You can't come out there and speak from your heart about the issues because you really don't know the issues. Like right. you bring up the fact that she's going to do something about inflation because it, because for some reason you think inflation is caused by price gouging. Yeah. Inflation is not caused by price gouging. Right. Those are two different topics. It's the distraction from the, from the, the problem of inflation. Exactly. Oh, it was price gouging. Oh, I'm gonna take care of that price gouge. Yeah. They can't do it's yep. just it's just another lie. They caused the inflation. Yeah. And they're not gonna fix inflation. Sometimes I just want to give up, but you know, the election's right around the corner. <laughs> it's tomorrow. It's tomorrow. Well, today if you see in the video, bro, but yeah. Well, it's today, actually. <clears throat> <laughs> it's actually today. <laughs> You're looking at the video. Yeah. But yeah, that's why this country sucks. It's yeah. it's a bunch of stupid women in this country. I wish I could say that wasn't the case, but it's true. You take the stupid woman vote out, this country's an oasis. Well, she's not stupid, she's misinformed. <laughs> Why would you go to the polls and vote for the things y'all are voting for? I would never understand. Show's over.